for all you conspiracy theorists, uh, Brian Windhorst, ESPN on GetUp, um, says, listen to the Cavs offseason moves to see if this happens. I will just point out, if you want to have a conspiracy theory, watch the Cavs moves over the next couple of weeks. <laughs> they are going to extend uh. Darius Garland, their all-star point guard. That is going to happen. But they have a couple of other moves that they can do that would potentially eat away their cap space for next year, which is what I would think that they would do as a young team. They should never be a free agent player. But if the Cavs do not retain Colin Sexton, and they do not extend Karis LeVert, which is two things on their menu of options, and they leave open their cap space in 2024 or 2023, it's just, it's interesting food for thought. Just keep an eye on that. And the thought being that if LeBron James does not pick up his option, that would be the reason that they're doing that. Uh, I would be surprised. Your thoughts on that, Sam? I'd be surprised too. Uh, you know, but it's hard to tell. Things are not going well or did not go well this last season with the Lakers for LeBron. Uh, and, and and actually, they went well for him. They didn't go well for the team. And, uh, you know, you can never... Uh, LeBron's from Akron. Brian Windhorst from Akron. You know, Brian knows what he's talking about. So <laughs> if he says to walk out for that, then, then there's probably something to... To keep an eye on it, it would be really interesting though i don't know that the Cavs uh would would want to go that route with this team you know when lebron's 39 years old or going to be turning 39 uh i i think there would be some hesitancy on the Cavs part uh as far as lebron coming back but all LeBron, all brian said was to keep an eye on it so that's what we'll do